This is total chaos. Desert City, it's like a war zone. All the houses is destroyed. It's gone. Everything Whoa. gone. Sweet home, Mama's here. So are you all hurt anywhere? Come on. We've been carrying this man with a severe spinal injury for over a mile. And any wrong move can make the situation worse. He's fine. He's conscious. So we have to meet up with our medic, Frank, who's arranged for a helicopter to transport him to a hospital. The Your spinal okay. cord injury needs to go in the helicopter. Okay, the baby is okay? Okay. Yeah, and there's your... Right here. Right there in the back of that truck. Right? I'm walking. Y'all go ahead and handle this. Hey, here's our medic. As soon as I rolled up, Joel advised me that uh, he was with a patient that was a possible spinal cord injury. What's your name, buddy? Lee Wood. Lee? Lee Wood. Okay, Lee. Do your best to push on my hand like you're pushing a gas pedal, okay? I really wish I could have been closer to Joel and Reed. There was 20 minutes in between them arriving and me arriving. Those 20 minutes make a big difference when it comes to, to life or death. No, push push with your feet like you're pushing a gas pedal. Push down. Uh, Are you trying, buddy? Push your foot down. Okay. Okay. He's got no function from his waist down, not able to feel anything, not able to move his extremities, uh, which are all classic signs of a spinal injury. Watch that, watch that. We're pinching his feet and he couldn't feel them, so he may be paralyzed. Keep your head as still as possible, buddy. I'm fixing to put a collar in it, okay? Uh, get me as stable as you can there. I've worked several tornadoes over the years to search and rescue. Yazoo City is by far one of the worst ones I've worked in. Did he lose consciousness? Well, we came up to the asylum. Oh, my God. It was probably 30 minutes after the tornado, though. Was it? Yeah, it was a long time. Yeah. To be honest, I feel completely underqualified to be out here and overwhelmed. It's humbling.